Hello, my name is Brianna. For my chemistry project this semester, I'm doing an experiment involving green beans. I decided I was going to see how plants reacted to being exposed to alcohol and soda, two things that are very bad for humans. Hypothesis. Alcoholics. I predict that the alcohol plants will have stunted growth. Alcohol is essentially a poison, so it will probably kill the plants faster. Hypothesis. Soda drinkers. I think the soda drinkers will last longer than the alcoholics. But I think the soda drinkers will still have stunted growth and be unhealthy due to how much sugar and carbonation they'll be exposed to. My first step was to pot the plants, which I did yesterday. I put about a cup and a half, two cups of soil in each pot, three seeds per pot. After that, I watered them for the first time. They all got a quarter cup of water. Once they began to grow, I decided that I would give them soda and alcohol. Just a little note. I tried this experiment before by putting alcohol in the plants that hadn't sprouted yet. Totally killed them. It was disgusting. There was mold, it, they didn't grow, and the seeds were all black. I just decided not to try that again. So I waited until the plant sprouted to give them any alcohol or soda because it just didn't turn out well. Okay, so I started putting alcohol and soda in the plants last week. And so far, they don't seem to be very affected by it. They're growing a little bit slower than the control plants, but they look just as healthy and green. The only thing that seems to be affected is the soil. It's gotten all spongy and kind of moth-eaten looking. I think it's mostly from the carbonation. I tried to prop the plants up on these little stakes that I bought to see if that would help them grow a little, like, more rigidly because they're sort of drooping. But that didn't really help. They, they haven't really <laughs> been doing anything. Okay, so it's been another week and the plants aren't doing very well. The controls have sprung up quite a bit and are starting to look very healthy and good, but the others aren't. They're still pretty short, they have way less leaves, and I mean, they're doing physically well. I mean, they're still green, they're not brown, they're still kind of growing. Um, one weird thing I did notice is some of the leaves, on the more on the alcohol plants than on the soda plants, are getting these little holes in them. Um, almost as if something is eating them, but there's nothing in my house that could be eating them, so I figure that might be the alcohol. It's been another week and the plants are deteriorating seriously. The soda plants' leaves are turning brown and are drooping quite a bit. The alcohol still look pretty okay, um, really green, but it's been two weeks and they haven't grown any taller. They're just kind of stuck at this one light height. Um, I'm going to keep giving them soda and alcohol. Yeah, I'm beginning to see where this is going. Hey, me again. It's been another three days. The soda plant's pretty much dead. Um, the leaves have shrunk into about a quarter of their size. Um, of the size of the control plant's leaves. When I'm using it for comparison. And, you know, they're just not growing. Not producing anything I could eat. So, purpose of plants. I mean these, these plants. The alcoholics are still doing okay. Their leaves keep drooping, or kind of wilting, and have become more hole-ridden, and the tips are turning brown. They seem to be going the same direction, because this is how the soda plants looked a week ago. So, Alright, so my project is essentially done. My plants have died, except for the control plants, which are blossoming beyond belief. So basically, in conclusion... Alcohol and soda are extremely bad for plants. Um, soda, for some reason, seems to be worse. It killed the plants much faster. And, I mean, I guess that's probably because of the sugar. Because they're both carbonated. I mean, like, I, mostly the alcohol plants were getting beer. They got, well, champagne's carbonated too. So, I guess it must be sugar. Plants really don't like sugar. I don't know if I could have guessed that, but... Um, the alcohol plants lasted quite a while, about a week or two longer than the soda plants. Um, didn't die nearly as quickly. But, this, this experiment proved my hypothesis partially right. I figured the soda plants would last longer because 
in case you haven't noticed, people don't often get addicted to soda and go on off tan go off on totally awful sprees and like you know ruin their family's lives, which is what alcohol tends to do to people. So I figured alcohol is more intense poison than just extremely sugary drinks. So I thought that, but the plants just really don't like sugar, but they're okay with, you know, alcohol, fermented grapes, or whatever alcohol is. So, um, that's the end of this. Don't give plants soda and alcohol. I could have told you that before I started. But if you have to pick one, go with alcohol. Don't know why.